How are you? Good. I hope you're doing well. We are going to do a reading. Um, we're going to be doing a reading for Pisces. Um, I hope you all are doing well. Um, this is going to be um, an intuitive reading for Pisces. I'm shuffling up the cards a little bit, all the decks. I hope you all are doing well. This is an intuitive reading for Pisces. Some change in our future we're having right now. Pisces, are you self-destroying yourself right now? I'm doing that so it buffers the noise so the rest of the house is in a way because I'm doing this before I get ready and go to work. You're embracing your love, but you're not claiming your work. Mm, you're hurting a cancer. Stacy's mom. Leo. A cancer. Anything else, divine team? Anything else, divine team? Pisces. 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 Okay, so Uranus is coming out for everyone. Pisces, you came out in your own reading. Libra did too. Sagittarius. Jupiter is being affected. So your Jupiter um, could be Pisces, Leo, Cancer, Sagittarius, or Uranus. Your ass can be Pisces, Leo, Sagittarius. Can't be Cancer because Cancer is reversed on their way out or left a situation of which was toxic because it was unknown. We just got done with the Uranus retro um, planet rotation. Um, it's interesting, you guys. That's the only planet you got. got a lot of people, Pisces. Um, and you're not taking care of yourself. It already your grandparents or your past ones have already told me that. Which I already saw the drinking too much card too. Um, I'm sure you obviously don't think that you are, but maybe you do, because that's why you're here, right? Because what's the point of watching Tarot if you're not, if your life is so perfect? Um, that's why Uranus, because the cool thing about opinions is they're like assholes and everyone has them, right? With age, we realize that. Well, actually, never mind. Not everyone does realize that kind of shit. Did I not say that? Maybe I visualized it before it came out. I don't know. I can't. I do both things, so I don't know half the time. Told you. 
choice you're feeling you're choosing to do you're cho you put yourself in a shitty situation you took the bait have fun for the bait something about now i'm hearing bait and switch what is that what does that mean again and that's like i don't know when someone baits so i'm assuming it is what it sounds like someone baits something and then as soon as they get it they switch I call it Ghostbusters, but I guess that's when they bounce. Why is Pisces feeling restraint? And why are they drinking? Yeah, why is Pisces feeling restraint? Now I'm hearing guilt. But I don't know. It's like guilt, 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 guilt. Do you have someone that's passed? I feel like I've read for this person before. Um, yes. Something's dang, yeah. You're covering shit up. In the past, you have, yep, covering up errors. Cover, I don't, yeah, I have read for you. You're that person where your husband or dad or uncle or someone keeps coming over and over and over and you do the same shit over and over and over like a broken record. it's better than me my friends call me strong and it's like no I just don't stick around it's not necessarily strong that's just choosing not to deal with bullshit like how is that strong you have a whole bunch of weak people like impacting you and seeing no repercussions and or giving a fuck like it's not strong But it's not this. I don't know what the fuck this is. Grieving your losses. Speak up. You're not doing any of these things, but I'm mad. All your cards are in reverse, Pisces, so what the fuck are you doing? You know? You think you know, you don't. You don't know, you just go, are you like a bobblehead? Do you not know? So you're just like, whatever, this is party time because I don't know and I can't figure it out. So I'll just pretend it is what it is. And if I don't get hurt, I don't. If I do, I do. So we're ignoring our feelings we are not thinking things through we are not thinking things through we're not speaking up about things we're just letting them happen as they happen if it doesn't work then you just party through it hurting yourself you don't grieve through losses and or past ones i told you you have a past person he's just shaking he doesn't even care he doesn't even want to fight anymore he's just like disappointed that would be the most appropriate word not in you, because that would give you a privilege. Um, disappointment in the fact that of all things that could have happened, this is what you chose, I suppose. Um, you don't even know how to take care of yourself right now. Why can they not take care of themselves right now? You're not being a teacher, that's for sure. You should not give people advice if you are. Because you can't even fucking... All you do is internalize your shit. Why would you give other people advice, right? Because you're going to make them stronger through the things that you fucked up on. That's the funny thing about kids is they turn out more fucked up watching you the more you fuck up. So actually, ironically, if you literally would just step out of their life, their kids' lives, kids would actually do way better than with the parents than in them. And if you're a parent, so you say it, it's true. You got shit. But whether you see it or not, right now, doesn't matter. Trauma is reality. Kids don't even understand trauma until they're the age of 25. So you got to fuck them up pretty bad by then. And then usually it's trauma back in the day. So if you're trying to, yeah, focus on sit. <laughs> what, what happens? I see as soon as I say this, soul family, call your tribe. You don't have to do it alone. Reverse. You don't trust yourself. 
you, what the f- this is like a weird ass person. You think you're wild and free or you know you are. There's no one like you. There's no one like you who chooses to stay bound, trapped, and go in circles and over drink. Have you not heard of like rock, like rock stars? Yeah, and I say it like this. Because there's many people that are rock stars. What is a rock star? Well, actually, that's a great thing. What is anything anymore? A rock star. So you are a rock star in a band? Or are you with someone? I don't understand. How did I know that? I'm more at party. Like if you're hanging out with fucking, well you can't anymore, but you're wrong. Rejuvenate, you're not doing that. Let go and enjoy. You're not doing that. Face your shadow, you're not doing that. And you're also not accepting what is dying. You're also not looking forward. You need to look forward, Pisces. You need to take responsibility of your life again. Are you going to? You need to brace out your cocoon, you're not. That's you, Pisces. You don't want to talk about you, obviously. It shows even in the cards, so let's talk and focus on someone else so you don't have to look at yourself in the mirror, okay? What sign is the person that passed for Pisces? What sign is the person that passed for Pisces? What sign is the person that passed for Pisces? Oh, interesting. He's way stronger than you, Pisces, and you will have never understood him. Never. You couldn't figure out karma. You guys, you, yeah, you. Really, Pisces? You, it was, this is a, wow. Pisces, if you were with someone that passed, they were an Aries or they were a Cusper. Or, there could be a very, 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 very small chance. Your Saturn could have been that. Your Saturn could have been that. But, no, it was an Aries. I'm a motherfucking emperor. Yeah. Yeah. Boss mood. And he was a dad. That took care of his kids. So you could call his kids pit bulls all you want, but it was a dad that took responsibility of his kids, so. And if a bitch shows up to her sit with her sister, is that not a pit bull? Like, just show up fucking alone. If you don't like that, show up with the police. Like, I don't know. I, I don't even believe in showing up with the police. I just believe in fucking humans talking to each other like fucking humans. Or guess what? If you can't go back, don't fucking go back to get your shit. Shit is material. You leave shit there so you can go back. It's called a plot. So maybe he wanted to checkmate your plot. Because you don't have boundaries. Or maybe she. Right? Okay, so we're going to be tapping in. You're not living your soul. That's the last card for that. Okay, now we're in Sagittarius. So Pisces did for Sagittarius. Pisces did for Sag. Sagittarius isn't, like doesn't 
has doesn't effort is something that they suck at. So biases of you have kids. These kids are not understanding effort. Neither of you know how to show effort and consistency on anything. So these kids are not going to know in life how to follow through with anything. You're going to have great kids that can't follow through, so the world's going to think shitty things of them. Is that really fair for the kids? Just saying. Painting the roses red, covering up air. Again. They're being taught. Wow. They're not ever going to be able to follow through with their word. So all they're going to do is spend their life disappointing. Because people love painting the roses red and covering up airs instead of actually fixing the shit. Okay. I guess that's... I'm not even fucking using tarot. Give me more for Sag. Dealing with this Pisces. Or this Pisces. Dealing with this Sag. And then, guys, we're going to do this reverse cancer, and we're going to do this up for Leo. Now, they do say, well, no, I shouldn't say that, because that's fire, period. They say fire signs are, can sometimes, but that's, no, I'm being told not, don't worry about it. Explain how Pisces and Sag can work on fixing this thing, where they both love covering up errors and not keeping up. gonna read that because you guys what you're being called to do go watch my other readings you want to know go watch them because you're not doing it so i'm not going to read what you could do so you could fantasize about what you are no we're going to deal with realism so i'm not doing tarot that's the way it is exactly exactly transformation in reverse no one's putting in the efforts and no one's transforming no one literally like as in all of you did I not say in the very fucking beginning of the reading? I can't shit my heart, Where do you need? I don't, what does that mean? What does that mean? There's none, that's the problem. So like, what, what does that mean? What does that mean? Because there's none. What does that mean? Because there's none. Let go and enjoy. No, that's not. Okay. You're not transforming. You're trying to cover shit up, but everyone's noticing it. So please just stop. You could do little things, little nitty ditties to make yourself. I mean, whatever, do it. Do it. You're gonna do it anyways. Whoever this is, Pisces, whether this is you or whether this is the side you're dealing with, I don't know. But you both literally do the most half-assed shit I've ever seen in my life. I don't know what to say. You're not going through deep healing. Neither of you are. Um, neither of you guys are creating anything for yourselves. Um, neither of you are letting go. Neither of you are keeping up. 
I don't understand. Okay, what 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 were you wanting to do? Like, what what is everyone even wanting to do? Is this like claim complacency, or I don't understand? Oh, someone's worried about kids. So you got a past one that's pissed off about the way the kids. I don't know something about the kids. You know. You know. I'm hearing you know. So, maybe you don't know. I don't, I know what I'm told, so I don't know. You know, but if you're stubborn, you're obviously not going to hear it. So I don't know who. <sighs> yeah, both reverse. You're right. I had to flip them. Neither of you are grounded. Neither of you are being highly sensitive. You're not being highly sensitive. You, If you feel sensitive, the reason you're sensitive is because your guilt is literally layering so much on you. It's a pity party. Um, you need to get grounded and connect to nature, but obviously we need to do a lot of things in life, yet here we all lay. What is not aligned or needs change? I'm sure you know that because it's been something that's been coming up often enough. That's why it's in the past. Like It keeps happening. You keep postponing, waiting, and having excuses. The no in reverse, so like in the past, like you keep making up excuses on why you're stagnant, yet nothing changes. I'm sure this isn't a tarot reading? Okay. We're moving on from Sag. Pisces and Sag, that was you. So now we're doing Pisces, nope. It's it, yeah, it isn't, that's about inspiration, which you're not going to just wake up from one little card today and be like, I'm going to change. You're gonna, so I'm not going to read it, period. Um, want me to start reading them all? Then start fucking doing shit, I guess. Um, we're going to be doing Pisces that are, <laughs> here's your wake up call. Like the same thing over and over and over. So the cards agree, I don't, yeah. Anyways, Cancer, the name of Pisces. Cancer that has their back towards 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 Pisces. Looks like we have a Cancer that walked away from you. They retreated. Um, because they felt as though Pisces, you were not able, you're not someone that knows how to build on solid ground. Which we know is true. Because Pisces, before we even started pulling cards for anyone other than you, all it was about is drugs and alcohol or partying or intoxicants and or things. You were miserable. So, you don't correct your mistakes. But then again, it's, it's inevitable because there are people around you that don't want to change their mistakes. So you guys kind of just go through life doing what you do, Rue. Do what you do, boo. Tell me more about this. Uh, whoever this cancer is, they wanted you to become clear on what you wanted. You pretended to be clear and or whoever pretended to be clear on what they wanted. Um, and I say pretended because you people pretend to put effort in. If someone wants to put effort in something, it's very apparent. If you want to do something, you do it. And you follow through with it. If your attention span is like a fly, guess what? If it's easy, it's from the devil. Every tarot reader in the world says that. Change in the night. You have changed very quickly. So, what this is coming, changing in the night and becoming a clearer channel. So, is this you or this Cancer sign? Okay, it's this Cancer sign. Why do I say this? You were rare and freeze reverse. Pisces, this is your card before we even shuffle this whole entire deck. This person does not see you. This Cancer sign, Pisces, does not see you as rare and free. They see you very clearly, and they see you as deceitful and untrustworthy.
You see, it's the one that needs to be in contact with the nature. Or maybe there's someone that likes to be in nature. They stepped away to get a fresher perspective, to get grounded, none of which anyone else so far has pulled up what they're doing. They're trying to work through disbelief and try to get a fresh perspective at things. Okay, tell me about this Cancer and Pisces. Well, even though they're not together, the Pisces reverse, but tell me again, anyways, about the Cancer and Pisces. I felt like a swatting, like someone was swatting someone's hand. So is everyone against this Cancer sign who looks like they're literally just trying to ground, build things, get, like, they're literally just trying to be alone. And they're getting their hands swatted. All they're trying to do is literally long. Fucking bullshit. And you know what? Maybe I should do tarot again just to be a fucking asshole. Because this is fucking bullshit. Fucking bullshit. You know why all the readers do this? Is because they don't want to fucking deal with your pathetic ass that goes in fucking circles. Crosswatcher or Pisces. Fucking bullshit. I want to watch and imagine how beautiful my life is when I do the same repetitive shit over and over and over and over and over like a fucking idiot. And then, it's just bullshit. I don't know. Pisces, you're trying to take a leap. Could be gathering, partying, all the above. I mean, we know you are showing up all throughout your reading. Anything else? Anything else that we need for Pisces dealing with the Cancer? I'm like finishing this up. Yeah, you're not patient and you're not yourself. You're not authentic to who you are. So whatever relationship you're in, it's in a false one because the person doesn't really know you. And or you're not being honest with the people around you about the shit you're in. Therefore, it's a toxic situation ship. So you want to talk about what you're in because it's built on lies. Pisces, dealing with a Leo. Last. And as soon as I'm done with this, I'm done. I have to go to work and get ready. Leo. this energy. Really right as I say that. Ask for sincerity. Focus on success. You're not focusing on success. Keep your commitments. You're not keeping your commitments. Or someone around. Oh, neither of you keep your commitments. Is this like a reading where Pisces and anyone around Pisces doesn't know how to keep a commitment? Therefore, no one around them knows how to keep commitments? Like keeping commitment, one commitment a month isn't keeping a commitment. But I think that's cute that you find that healthy. Ask with sincerity. What are we asking? The truth? What?
repetition, the same shit over and 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 over. It would change tomorrow, it would change today, it would change in the future, over and over and over and over and over. I always find it intriguing because the ones that don't change are always the ones that push people to change or the ones that hide from people. If they can't look you in the eye, that says a lot about them. But they can't sit and stare at you in the eye when they talk to you and they avoid you. That is someone that we all know can't even look at themselves in the face. Focus on success. We're not doing that. So, the right way. Learning to create what you desire. So, you could have wanted a new opportunity. It didn't work out. So, you're going to something else. Working through disbelief. Imagine leaps in a fresh perspective. And that is on like keeping your commitments and when it comes to you're saying no to you're feeling blocked and restraint but that's a way of thinking so you need to say no to yourself and move forward but i don't know what to say because it seems like you have people around you 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 all just do the same shit in circles so i don't know what why either one of you expects each other to change when you both such a curious dream neither no one's grounding no one's returning to Reality, no one's coming home, like. Okay, I'm done. The own Pisces was not the luckiest, but maybe next week, right? Um, so let's see about the Leon Pisces, if there's anything that we can tell them. That is gonna be through a higher divine connection that we can get through to what we need to. Pisces, you're so blocked. Like, it's unreal. You're crashing the threshold, and you're going to let it devour you. It's obviously because of Venus retrograde and Mercury retrograde. Oh my gosh, my emperor friend, he's so fucking adorable. He's like, oh my gosh, so did you know Mercury went through retrograde? <sighs> I was listening to what you said, and I was like, oh my gosh, that is so fucking cute. He listens to me. No one does. Okay. If you are dealing with a Leo, you guys need to take a break. If you're dealing with anyone, you need to take a break, but... If you're dealing with a Leo, you need to take a break. Oh, okay, so you're seeing multiple people. You're supposed to be channeling and uplifting people, but you can't uplift yourself, so um, I guess the break's going to remind you of that. Give me, nope. Trust the niggle. One more for Pisces, one more for Pisces, one more for Pisces, one more for Pisces. Crossing the threshold. One more for Pisces, one more for Pisces, one more for Pisces. You need to become a clear channel of what you even want in life. It's very evident. You're a grown up, so I guess I have it. You had your whole life to figure it out, but I guess not all of us do. I don't know what to say to that. Um, shine bright like the candle you are. You will make it through this. Well, you won't make it through until you decide what you want, because how can you make it through the threshold if you don't even know how to get to the other side and or do things? So... You're out a lot of evaluating, dude. It's really not that much, but you're going to make it a big deal because that means you actually have to do something. So I'm going to end it there. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate and love you guys. And I hope you guys have an amazing, amazing day. Bye.